going down for real. Yo, what is up, my lovies? It is your girl, Heather, here. And today we are bringing you guys a secret, a little surprise. I am going to show you guys how to make the perfect pet. How we, when you see everybody and they've got these absolutely perfect pets and you're wondering, how did they do that? Because I hatch and I hatch and I hatch and I, it doesn't work for me. This is going to be your tutorial that th is going to save you. <laughs> you're just going to be... Let's just get started. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is make sure you have enough gold and find the pet you want that has all the talents you want, not a pet that has three good talents and one failed pet talent. You want to have all the talents you want, and you want that pet to come out just like that. Okay, so what you're going to do, and the reason why you're going to do this, I'll explain, but the first thing you need to do is get max gold not only get max gold but uh do it twice the first max gold get in powers and then max gold on your character because whoever you're hatching with you want to try to hatch with them you're going to need to hatch with them four or five times so you need to be able to pay for the the hatches and not only that but help the person that's hatching with you pay for hatches also so make sure you're ready before you hatch okay how to make the perfect pet or copy someone's pet. Here we go. Um, you're going to come over here and buy a piggle. You are going to take the piggle, grow it to adult, which I'm going to show you that. Grow it to adult and then hatch with that person's pet. And you're going to continue this process until you feel confident that the pet is ready to grow further than adults okay sorry about the dogs guys and nothing i can do about it they just bark at random and i can't help it but i can drink some dr pepper while they're barking because you know they're too loud i love me some dr pepper in the morning yo nothing better okay so when you've got the piggle let's 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 equip our piggle because i want to want to you know where's our piggle Okay, George, Gigi's right there. She's not even hatched yet. She needs, what, four minutes? Well, we're going to go ahead and hatch her so that we can um, get it over with. So I can show you guys a little better hatching elixir. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Hatching elixir. Okay. Now our piggle. I bought it. I need to get more crown. Okay, now our piggle is there. Oh He's green. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. You're going to want their pet. You're not going to keep this pet. You're going to keep hatching till you have their pet. Because having the piggle, you'll have more of the piggle challenge. So you, you definitely want to make sure you, you get the looks of their pet in doing this. Because that's going to help you. Okay. Now what I'm going to show you is... How to, um, well, first we got to grow to adult. Let's go back out here. Sorry, Chris. I'm like telling you, go here, go there. We got to grow to adult, which I forgot, which I'm going to show you guys how to do it the easiest way to get it to adult. A lot of people use cheat engine. That's fine. Um, you can look it up. It's called cheat engine, but this is how I do it. Okay. So I just start the game. I just play any game like that. And I press play. And I sit there and let the game, I don't touch anything, I just let the game play out. Just let it play out for all three things. And then when it comes time to feed the pet, I just go to that and then I feed the pet. The reason is, the reason I do it that way is because it actually is faster than actually playing the game. You just let it, and like I'll be talking to somebody or um, doing something and I can grow a pet easily that way or I can write down ideas for videos while I'm growing my pet and that way you don't have to sit here and play the game it, unless you like playing the game that's up to you and you just hit next and feed it something okay so that's how you get it to adult once you get it to adult here let me go through all this make sure because I wrote everything down after you get the piggle train it to adult with the pet games okay you're going to hatch the piggle with the pet that you want, that exact pet that you want. 
train that baby to adult. Take the baby and hatch again. And you continue doing this until you feel confident to train the pet to mega. So you're going to always use the baby. Each time you're going to take the new baby, grow it to adult, and hatch it. Then you take that new baby, grow it to adult, and hatch it. So you're going to have to make sure you don't get those confused. So the minute that it, um, the minute that it hatches, it comes up over here, you press equip. That way you know, okay, the new pet is equipped, and you don't get any of the old one mixed up. And you keep going until, okay, until you feel confident. And here's about the pools. I'm going to teach you a little about that, okay, so that you can see when um, you should feel confident. I'm going to look at my pet. Wait, let me go the other way. This one. Now, you see the dots right there. I'm going to teach you guys what those dots mean, okay? Um, the piggle has its talents, but you want, let's say I'm going to hatch with this pet. I want these talents, okay? So I'm going to look at the pool when I'm hatching. So let's go back to the piggle for a minute. Okay, there's the piggle. Okay, I can see all the talents right here. Uh, uncommon, rare, uncommon, common, 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 uncommon. So I know what's there. We are one dots, two dots, one dots, one dots, okay? So we go back over to our other pet. Okay, now we look at our other pet's pool. Now we know that the piggle had nothing with four dots, okay? Four dots is epic, okay? So our spell proof is epic. So you want to look for that to come in on the, um, the piggle. That's showing that, you're, that you spell proof. If, if it gets three uncommons, then you know you've got spell proof on your pet, okay? Defy is two. And you see there's a two here, and that's it, just two twos. If there comes two twos on that piggle, you know that that's there. Coming down to uncommon, which is just one dot, you looked at the other pet. So see, what you're going to do is just look for these, in, look, take a picture of the pet you're hatching with, compare it to each one. You know, wh Trust me, the first couple are not going to you know, just get the talents. So do, hatch it a couple and then start looking at the talents. As you're growing it to adult, you're going to see a few talents show up. You're going to get to a point where when you're hatching, it's only showing your talent, you know, the talents that you want. And that's when you start looking at it. So this is what all you got to do is kind of compare these with the other pet. Now I'm going to teach you guys a little bit about what the dots are and what they carry. So uncommon, which is one dot, is things like fairy, any giver. Storm giver, balance giver, anything like that. It is also um, add balance, add six universal damage. That's the giver. Um, the add balance or add um, st storm, add whatever. That's the three. Gives the three damage. So things like traps, fairy, giver, add balance, they're all uncommon. Rare is stuff like Sprightly can be rare, and that's really sticky, by the way. But Spell Defy, which is the five um, resist, it also is Bringer, the plus three damage. So that's rare. That's some of the things rare gives. Ultra Rare is three dots, and it gives stuff like, um, let's see, it can give stuff like Dragon Blades. It gives Storm Dealer, Balance Dealer, all the dealers, which is the 9 or 10 damage. It can give it, it can give a Critical Hitter, which is the plus 20. And that's some of the things that Ultra Rare can get. Epic gives stuff like Spell Proof, which is the plus 9 or plus 10. Resist, which is awesome. But I also can give Unicorn, which is not so awesome sometimes, depending on what you want. Um, it gives Critical Striker, which is the plus 27 balance blade and it also has the may casts which is like this that's why i was showing it um your may casts like 
they can come in that too, which is they may cast like Pierce, might cast Healing Current. That can come in Epic also. So now that you know the things that come with these, okay, so you can get underneath um, like Rare. You can get Spelldefy, which is right here, which is the two dots is Rare. You can get stuff like Sprightly, Spelldefy, which is plus five to resist, Painbringer, which is the plus three uh, damage. Just go through them, guys, and that's you know, everything. I you might want to write down what I told you, like write one dot, uncommon, and write down that it can be things like curse, trap, uh, fairy, storm giver, balance giver, any of the givers. Um, add balance, which is the plus three damage. Um, then go to the two dots rare, which is sprightly, um, spell defy, pain bringer, um, ultra rare which is uh, plus six universal damage, storm dealer, any of the dealers. Um, it could also be sharp shot, dragon blade, storm dealer, critical hitter. I already said storm dealer. Epic, spell proof, which is a good one. Unicorn, critical strikers, a plus 27. Um, and then your may cast, which is may cast balance blade, um, tower, healing current, pierce, storm, storm assailant, things like that. So now that you have a little idea of what to do, starting with a piggle is what I do to make a pet. And I get the get it, I keep hatching until I get that exact pet. Because when I hatch with my pet, you know, my pet already has talents. So those some of those talents are sticky. So if I have a bad talent in the about have a couple of talents in my pet that I don't want, which is obviously why I'm hatching those talents are going to keep showing up. So starting with a clean, fresh pet that doesn't have any sticky talents in it, just easy to get rid of, is your best bet. So you guys have just learned the secret of hatching and how you can get the perfect pet. If you guys didn't understand anything I said, because I know I talk really fast, um, comment down below and I get a little confused when I um, am reading off of a piece of paper which is hard but I had to make sure I got the facts right for you guys um, so but if there's anything you want to know or you know anything I didn't cover in hatching about this let me know um, if you guys want a, a video on where to get the best uh, mega snacks in the game I can give you that give you the planning tips let me know that also in the comments um, so yeah Good luck getting your perfect pet. I hope you guys liked this. Try it. It works. It's awesome. And I'll check you guys out later. This is Heather out. Bye. Mwah. Yeah.